中文教学视频 Chinese Teaching Video， 读音 Pronunciation， 呀呀，笔画 Strokes， 呀呀呀，解释，呀，拼音呀。汉语常用字，一级字、象形字，最早见于《说文小传》。本意指物体上端分叉的部分，压是分叉的部位，表示次要的、不受重视的。因此，压也借用来指丫头，指女孩子或旧时工使役的女孩。Explanation: Bifurcation, pinyin ya, commonly used Chinese characters, first level characters, pictographic characters, first seen in Shu and Xu Shuang. The original meaning refers to the bifurcated part of the upper end of the object. Bifurcation is the bifurcated part, which means secondary and unimportant. Therefore, bifurcation is also borrowed to refer to girls, girls or girls who were used for service in the old days. Basic meaning. Basic meaning. Basic meaning. Basic meaning. Basic meaning. Basic meaning. meaning. Branching of a tree or object. Ya, 向物开之形。按，这是中古所造的字，泛指上端分出的东西。Bifurcation, like the shape of an open object. Press, this is the word created in the Middle Ages. Generally speaking, it refers to something that is separated from the upper end. Yacha, 树木两只分歧处，两手交叉，鸭子物体分叉的地方。Ya fork, where two branches of a tree diverge, hands crossed. Yesi, where an object forks. Like branches of a tree, a girl's head is crossed by two branches, like a branch, so it is called a girl. Like the forks of a tree branch, girls wear double buns on their heads like tree forks, so they are called girls.
鸭吱吱鸭，鸭把插草用的农具，鸭茶鸭叉，植物的枝丫，鸭鹿岔鹿。鸭吱 twigs， 也 palladium a farm tool used for forking grass。鸭吱也 fork， branch of a plant。鸭鹿 fork road。组词 ，word group， 鸭叉，鸭叉，鸭叉，鸭患。丫鬟，丫鬟，吱呀，吱呀，吱呀。丫头，丫头，丫头，丫鬟，丫鬟。丫鬟，鸭吱，鸭吱，鸭吱，鸭记，鸭记。鸭记，鸭，鸭，鸭。下课 ，after class。